Thank you very much. There is a whole generation of kids growing up today learning about D-Day in their history class. To them, it's something that happened a lifetime ago. But as Kathy Hart tells us, they know it has made a difference in their lives. More than a thousand planes transported them from England to France. Students in this seventh grade English class at Watts Middle School in Centerville are learning all about D-Day. Some of them are surprised to learn many of the soldiers that fought on the beaches of Normandy that day were very young, just a few years older than they are now. I can't imagine that. I mean, you're, you're 18 and you have your whole life ahead of you and you look death right in the eyes and you realize that you could get shot any moment and die. Thousands of soldiers did die that day, most of them Americans landing on Omaha Beach. They had to scale cliffs and a seawall to capture it. Germans were at the top, firing down at them. To walk up a mountain and have people firing at you would be probably the worst thing that could ever happen to a person. Kind of amazing what they did. Yeah, it's a very heroic thing. You need to have a real good understanding of the, the effort that was made there the courage that was displayed there and the results that were gotten there. Students here say they are in awe of the bravery of the soldiers entering enemy territory by sea and by air. Many of them paid the ultimate price trying to stop Hitler and the Nazis. These people are heroes and courageous people that risk their lives for us today and for the future of America. I think we have an understanding of what the people fought for, what Americans fought for and died for, and how they uh, helped save lives. D-Day to me is the day where people risk their lives to save their country and other people from um, Hitler destroying the world. A world that still stops to remember all the lives that were lost and all that was gained on that day 50 years ago. In Centerville, Kathy Hart, 2 News. Now coming up at 6, we'll talk with another generation of...